hi friends in the last video we created this wonderful website this is a business website with multiple home pages and it is a perfect website of course during the process of importing the demo content it was instructed by the theme developer that we need to set certain php parameters like maximum execution time memory and all such things before we start the demo content if you have taken the hosting via wp themes website you are getting all the controls of your hosting via cpanel i mean you are having a uh, complete access of cpanel and through which you can really change the php parameters whatever is required for your theme installation or demo import like we seen in the last video we can edit php ini files for uh, installations and we can simply change the maximum execution time input time maximum input variables and memory limit and all such things but not all installation have this cpanel i mean you are using uh, you might be using a uh, different hosting and you don't have access on the cpanel and you cannot set the php parameters according to the requirement of theme like i will show you this theme uh, is asking for uh, limits like a php value upload max file size is 1000 m and php value post max size is 2000 m memory uh, should be 3000 m and similarly so if you are not having php uh, access i mean php ini access how you can change this values so it is a very important thing before you start importing them demos and even in other themes when the installations are willing to import the demo content they generally get a very common error uh, error 500 or demo import failed or similar errors because they don't have the adequate php parameters so what is the solution we seen in the last video uh, i have shown a plugin called uh, wp ht access editor that was suggested in this theme as well but i am making this separate video for those people who are uh, trying to import the demo content and they are getting demo import failure notices and they don't have access on the cpanel and still they want to use their own hosting i mean different hosting plan, uh, plan rather than cpanel access and all so what we can do simply to edit the h php values that is required for the theme so i'll again open this uh, under uh, carbon demos it was there so we need to edit all such things and suppose we don't have access on the cpanel what we can do we can simply install a plugin called wp ht access editor and i'll show you how simple it is to edit the ht access value and we can change the php values as well so we can do this simply by using this free plugin and this is htaccess file editor i will definitely add the link in the description of this video you can download this plugin and you can safely edit htaccess file in and you can change php parameters as per your requirement so it is by a renowned developer that is web, web factory limited and they actually make wonderful plugins for wordpress and this is a very useful plugin and through this plugin uh, it provides a simple and safe and fast way to edit fix and paste the site's htaccess file from uh, wp admin itself and it is being updated time to time so don't worry it is very safe to use and you can e easily edit the htaccess and you can change the php parameters so i have already downloaded this plugin and this is the plugin and we are going to use for changing the values let us install this plugin first of all mm, i will show you how simply it can be done in the plugin we can add new plugin upload plugin choose file select install now 
just keep in mind that is just an alternate solution the best solution is to edit the values through the php and ini editor through the c panel or whatever the control panel you are having so if you are not having access on your control panel or you don't have the complete control over your hosting you can use this plugin alternatively it does not mean this is the solution this is an alternate solution only okay so we have installed the plugin activated as well and we can directly go to the setting and it will show you the certain information like you can read all these things and we have uh, to accept all these things and I understand edit enable the PHP values and in, I will must tell you you can take a backup of htaccess file and before you start editing the htaccess so again you need to go in your file manager and, and you can uh, download the htaccess again I'll show you how you can do this this is the file manager from the cPanel and you can use uh, this uh, get the htaccess through ftp as well like let us say if we are having this uh, instance this is wordpress instance and this is htaccess file and we can simply right click and download this file just in case if it is not visible go to the setting of cpanel and enable this so hidden files dot files so if it is disabled this this htaccess file will not be visible so you can enable or disable the uh, dot files as per your requirement and download the htaccess before you start editing htx and now uh, this is the htaccess and we can simply change the values wherever required and it is very simple but yes it is actually required and like php memory you we, you, we can change like 3000 m is here so we can and change it to 1000 m and again here 1000 m and simply save the changes and you can even test the mm, php i mean htaccess before saving it so and you can even restore the last backup so let us check the effect we have changed the memory to 1000 m and uh, for checking this we can go directly to the what we score installation and i can show you in another tab under tools we have site health and under info we have server and like php memory limit is again 3000 m here we can replace this So it is simply changed, but but yes, uh, it is memory limit is now 1000 m. But keep in mind, uh, it is uh, for changing the htaccess value. If you are changing any values through the uh, control panel, it is not going to alter those values. So if we have kept anything else like values are different from the htaccess, this will be effective, not the htaccess as I believe. So uh, you can simply control the values of PHP parameters that you need for your WordPress hosting and it is an effective way when you are not having the access on the uh, cPanel or PHP INI. So this can be alternate solution as I said and uh, again you can change the different things like mm, if you are willing to change the HT access for some different reason if your theme developer is suggesting to do uh, like uh, mod rewrite values and there are different things that can be added in the htaccess file you can simply edit those files as well through this but yes make sure you taste before saving and keep it safe and as i said you can take a backup of your existing htaccess file so it is very important okay so this is a solution and i believe it will help you in uh, installation of wordpress themes and importing the demo content and let us meet in our another video in which i am going to bring another based wordpress resource for you thanks for watching